My youth experience as a teenager was probably close to non-existent. I didn't like it. Uh, I didn't have any leaders that I connected with. I didn't have any people my own age that I connected with, and so I tried to avoid it as much as possible. I wasn't going down a good path involved with just lots of partying and making bad decisions with my life. God showed me who he was and, and pulled me over to his fold and he showed me what I could do for him. As professor of the youth ministry at Columbia, a lot of times we get students like Luke who, who really want to jump in and do the practical thing immediately. Do I have to go to school? But that's a progression, it's a journey. And you know, they hit them with some of the solid Bible and theology classes that they just need to kind of crown this thing with. I think the best thing the youth work program offers is the one year internship. For our youth work students to go through all four seasons and be involved in youth ministries, you see it all. In a 10 month, you're like, okay, pace yourself. Don't burn out in the first two. And it's something that is hard to do for rookie youth workers because you just want to go, 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 go. They'll be mentored by someone who's in the trenches and walk with them through ministry. The middle school pastor, Dan Sparrow, he has 15 or so years of youth experience and just having him there and looking out for my well-being and being able to correct me and teach me. Every single time we talked, I, I was learning something. Churches are looking for gifted and called young men and women who desire to make a difference in the world that we live in. So I think it's a great opportunity. The youth work program made me who I'm becoming. I want to be there for kids when I had no one there for me. My name is Luke, and I'm Carlton Tax Students. Wow.